Well, we've got some world-renowned evolutionary biologists coming to the campus at Ohio Northern University. And to tell us more about it, we have Jay Mager, and he is an Ohio Northern University professor in the School of Science, Technology, and Mathematics. And thanks for joining us, Jay. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thanks for having me. Um, I'm really excited about our speakers who will be coming in in uh, mid-April and knock on wood, we'll get everything ready to go. Yeah, exactly. So this is a lecture series that the university does, right? And so I assume it changes for the speakers all uh, monthly or how often do you have these lecture series? Yes, this is the Terry Kaiser Distinguished Lectureship in Life Sciences and it's a lectureship that we have every year. Uh, we host usually a nationally or internationally acclaimed scientists in the natural uh, sciences. And um, we've been doing this since 2007, and we've brought in some pretty prestigious people, such as Sylvia Earle, uh, who is a scholar with National Geographic. We brought in um, David Quammen, a world-renowned author. Um, and this year, we have the pleasure to bring in Peter and Rosemary Grant from Princeton University. Yeah, and I mean, they're going to talk about the nature of the Galapagos, right? And so what are they going to focus on? What kind of stuff? Well, it's a great question. Um, they're really world-renowned evolutionary biologists, and Peter and Rosemary have um, basically spent the last 40, 45 years or so uh, researching evolution uh, in the Galapagos Islands. Uh, they were actually the subject of a Pulitzer Prize-winning book called The Beak of the Finch, and their work has really um, been done to elaborate and elucidate some of the mechanisms of evolution. And uh, they've been able to show and demonstrate that evolution can occur quite rapidly. And um, that's led to really interesting questions about speciation and um, some of the pressing uh, environmental factors that have impacted the Galapagos. So they'll be talking a little bit about their work in evolutionary biology, as well as about the beauty and the uh, diversity of life that are found in the Galapagos. Yeah, you know, I've never been there, obviously, but I mean, you always see it through videos and documentaries. It's a beautiful area. So um, to learn more about that area must be really neat, not only for you and your students, but the public's invited to come too, right? That's it. Everybody is welcome to attend. It's really to expose um, the whole Northwestern Ohio community to really um, fascinating people um, and, and scientists in, in this case, uh, evolutionary biology. Um, it's really to involve students uh, and provide interactions that they wouldn't otherwise have. Uh, these are people that are usually, um, you know, talking on a lot of uh, interesting circuits and and to actually have them be involved in interacting with us as well as with our students we we couldn't be prouder so that's kind of neat that they focus on the finch and um obviously it's changed a lot then and that's what you're we're going to learn through the research what they've learned about the finches that's true and not, not just the finches but really how the environment and and you know uh, the social environment of the finch, finches can really influence a lot of change that can be seen again within uh, one or two years, which I think is really kind of fascinating. And it gets a really beautiful part of the world. So if anybody's never been to the Galapagos Island, I'm sure we're going to be um, en enchanted by a, a number of um, pictures, images, and stories from the grants. They're just really re remarkable people. Uh, they're internationally recognized science, and they're just wonderful down-to-earth people who I think are also passionate about education and, and um, working with the community. So we couldn't be uh, more pleased to have them come to Ohio Northern. Yeah, you know, you talk about how they they are such, I mean, they've won tons of awards and stuff. I was looking them up and stuff. And so it is really neat to have this caliber come to the campus. That's it. I think it's, it's something that, you know, that was the whole um, idea behind the Kaiser lectureship. It's an a million dollar endowed um, uh, grant that, uh, or fellowship, I should say, through the university that uh, really has provided opportunities for this entire community to um, interact personally and professionally with some of the biggest names in science. And so I'm, I'm really tickled pink to, have, to be able to have them come. All right. Well, I'm glad you're inviting the public and us. Again, it's Wednesday, April 17th, starts at 730 in McIntosh Center. Jay, thank you very much for joining us today and telling us all about it. Oh, it's my pleasure. I really enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, anything that I can be of help with, my email address is j-m-a-g-e-r at o-n-u dot e-d-u. Feel free to reach out. All right. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us on Noon Edition. My pleasure. Thank you so much for having me. All right. Don't go away. There's more coming up after this.